All right, so we head in. Red Jackie Peanuts. Red right. having lost to the sea earlier today to um, Nameless 2-0 in winner's quarters. Okay. Jackie having lost to Lucky 3-0 okay. in winner's semis. So that both of them lost in winner's to, to easy sets, like full sets. Not oh. easy sets, but full sets. Yeah. They were, um, they were the set with Jackie and Lucky was really fun to watch. Though. It was very cool. It was close. All right, going to game one on Smashville. Um, standard neutral, going back and forth. Set the complicated, the complicated thing here for Red is going to be that Jack, all Jack wants to do is to not be near him, and all Red wants to do is to be on top of Jack. Right. So it's this, this complex like whose whose tools are better off for that sort of game, and I think Nesses are better for the getting in, and obviously for the punishment is there. Right. But Jack's going to be slippery, and he exactly. needs to be slippery, and he's proven that he can be very slippery. Um, still. Little in Red's favor here, but it's oh, yeah. still looking pretty even. The throw provision not going to work out with the can. Not quite. He's still getting the up air. Setting up the can behind him. It's a good thing to fall back on. And you'll notice what like Jack's doing right here. If you sit on top of the can as Duck Hunt, you have these great options where if the opponent approaches you, you can sit and shield and just pop the can and then punish that approach. Ooh, ooh that was a really nice edge guard. I think what he wanted was the back hit to knock Red into the stage to force a deck chase. Ooh. Right, no setup, not going through. So close. And that back ooh, air will take it. Yeah, yeah, that was uh, definitely with assisted DI. Yeah. It's so hard to want to fade in this game and then to be oh, hit by an attack like that and die. Yeah. Wow, ooh, can going yeah. straight to him. Excellent uh, aiming. Yeah, that was amazing. Also like that he did it with the backer, so if he needed to, he could still jump it back. Ooh, and the gunman ooh. survived the PK fire the whole time just That's, to hit red. That's surprising. Usually the gunman died pretty quick. It looked like the PK fire had proc just above him enough where it didn't actually hit him. Oh, uh, yeah, like, that very well could have been. Oh, yeah. Ness's up air is going to be the problem oh, this matchup. I mean, look at this. Yeah, I'm getting what, what does Duck Hunt have to answer that? It's too disjointed. It's too quick. Yeah, and then it's really hard to get around that PK Thunder juggle as well. Yeah, with no can, this is a really yeah. He's really over high, and then fade, excellent fade. That was great. Back throw. Oh, Hummel going for the back throw. Mashes out. Good. Hardly. Set. Hardly yeah. mashed. Yeah. And then up air will take it. Yeah. yeah. That was rough. Good read on the ledge get up by Red. Um, Red taking game one. I'm kind of curious to see where Jackie will take him. I assume Red would probably ban FD. I don't know. At least I would. So, yeah, so going, going to Omega Suzaku. Oh, sorry, Omega Wily's Castle. I yeah, know. I remember hearing this is one of Jackie's favorite stages. And I'll have to agree with him. I love the Mega Man stage. Well, Wily's it's, Castle is great. it's great for a couple reasons. It's great because the can can ride the edge. It's great because right. um, FD is by default uh, Duck Hunt's stage. Right. Um, ooh, yep, he's going to break ooh, out of that that's throw. Good. Unfortunately, he gave him a little more damage in the process, but you can definitely punish Ness's down throw. Any long time right. throws with can. Yeah, I mean, he definitely took a lot less percent than he would have from a standard down throw combo. Oh, yeah. Ness, though. So, I like that roll behind there. Yeah, that was great. And this is what I was saying earlier, where if Jack keeps Ness at this, at this distance, where right. he can comfortably chuck things and respond to things that Red's doing. It's great. This is one of those matchups where perennially, as the as it happens in Smash Brothers, the person who presses the button second wins. Yeah. And I think that Jack's right here trying to throw out jabs and down tilts and trying to do all these things where Red can just react. Right. And will win the interactions. Ooh, gorgeous. Good stuff. Right, set up. I yeah. love that down beat. Stall is so real. Stall is so hard to deal with. Oh, I know. As soon as you think you can punish it, you're getting hit by something. It's so hard. Or the throw. Yeah. Control here. I like it. Lightly smacked the can. Yeah. That was a really strange. Yeah, I thought it would have at least gone somewhere, but I think because it's just been kicked, it can't, I believe. Could be. The first time it either has to explode or. Oh! What an update. Yeah, I tried to down smash. Uh, but I believe the gunman extended the hitbox a little yeah. bit to actually hit him. Oh, up there again. Oh, escaping with the can. Yeah. Oh, go. Wants to be that spacing. Good Not idea with the up Yeah, just barely misspaced it. Backers to get him off stage. Oh, I like that PK Thunder to hit the can. Still grab ledge. It's a lot easier for him. Red really showing he knows how to get in on this character. 
Zach's not going down without a fight, though. I love that. Yeah. Up air was great. That up air was great, too. It's such a difficult thing. Both characters, they seem to be doing, they do best aerially if they are below the other. So there's constantly this jockeying for midair, who's where, who's occupying the airspace. Ness has a much easier time getting underneath Duck Hunt just because of the way his jumps work and the directional air dodge he can, or the, the, the directions he can pull during his air dodge. Right. But when Duck Hunt is underneath Ness, it is it's, a great opportunity for some oh, strong punishes. Yeah, that up air is just ridiculous. It just you know, how it combos. The one thing I'm saying Jackie is not respecting at all is the, the variance of airspeed that Ness can, can form with fast falling, all these things. Oh, I know. He keeps getting hit with these landing. Ah, oh, that's not good. Uh, that should be it. Uh, oh, good cool. DI. See how he can get back though. This is when he's taking a lot of damage just from recovering. Oh, no, that should, dude. Yep. Oh. All right, game two going to red. All right. Will we see a switch to Mario game three, or is this gonna be an all Duck Hunt tournament? This is the sort of question that I'm sitting through right now. Yeah, I mean, I think I'd like to see a switch. Stick him with the Duck Hunt. Okay, stick him with your gut. Actually, I'd, I like that. Talk me through it. Why would you want to see a switch to Mario? I just. With how Red has been getting in on him so consistently, having some sort of playstyle switch could be really beneficial. Because he's obviously seems to have quite the read on his duck hunt right now. So the counterpoint is Red plays most often the Kingdra on Mario. I did not know. So they they always do doubles together and this sort of thing. I don't know if right. they play most often together, but they certainly play often. Right. Okay, well, so you know that is. I would probably not say that, then. <laughs> Even still, I think it's... It's a, I feel uh, like Duck Hunt loses this matchup, but I, I guess I can't quantify precisely why. There are things I think Jack can be doing, there are things that, that Red can be doing differently that would make the matchup better or worse for either of them. I, I don't know. Yeah. Ooh, that was a good win. Little Smackway Nair is probably the worst thing in this matchup. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, one thing I haven't seen Red do yet is try to two frame with his down smash. Yeah, Jackie keeps like recovering it. low. Yep. And that down smash. And that's actually a really a normal thing for Dread. I, I certainly see him doing it quite a bit. Um, yeah. It's sort of an internet habit because it's very easy to punish people on Wi-Fi with that kind of thing. For sure. Oh, that PK fire does so much damage. Even just like getting three, four hits of it. Unfortunately, Jack now has to play to not lose, which is such a yeah. hard spot. It's to be in. It's rough. It's not it's a, character like, a character like Ness, where one big mistake will cost you 30%, yeah. and then two of those put you in death percent. Yeah, it's it's scary. Oh, yeah, the chase is rough. Ooh, get up there. Yeah, it hit both the PK Thunder and Ness. That was actually yeah. pretty good. I like the fade back with the downer there. Yeah, kind of covered the roll, kept him safe. PK Thunder. Really slow gun in there. Yeah. A faster one would have set up a really interesting trap there. Yeah. I'm kind of curious if Duck Hunt has any moves that can contest that PK Thunder besides up there. Uh, apparently, Swan and can. Yeah. That was strange. Yeah. Because I know the Bayonetta, I just forward air it. Yeah. But, oh, is that going to. Ooh. Excellent fast fall to get through the frame trap that would have been. And the upper should take it. Yeah. yeah. And with that, good stuff to red. 3 0 to red. Still a good effort from Jackie, though. He kept, he put up a fight. It wasn't like a complete sweep. Absolutely.